Last time on Persona 5 Strikers. Hey, Shorty, get your ass over here! <laughs> Everyone just... <laughs> now, back to the ass kicking. Hey, Futaba. Mm, I back see. into it, I know. What? Ooh. Oh, Ow. she's not gonna hear us. I mean, with this over here? Damn. Yeah. So that's it. Yep. She's not gonna hear us. She's not gonna hear us. Don't even bother. So, what do you think, Butaba? How Sophia's killed you? <sighs> we already All know she's not gonna hear us. The programmer is a genius. Oh. No doubt about that. Huh. You can figure a person out by their code, and not just their skill level. Their habits, thought processes, even their personalities are there. Yeah. This code is so advanced that even I can't read it and comprehend it right away. It'll take me weeks, even months, to actually grasp how Sophia works. Take you months? Ooh, that's a serious program. Damn. I don't understand. Do you mean I'm impressive? Yeah, you're impressive. Yeah. <laughs> you're some kind of super AI. If you ever went public, everyone would call Emma old hat. Old hat? <laughs> when something was popular at one point but stopped being popular, it becomes old hat. It's a saying people don't really use anymore. The, okay. So it became old hat itself. It. Nice. You're very knowledgeable, Futaba. Don't go teaching her too much weird stuff, okay? While we're at it, did you see anything about Sophia's past? Her programmer's name? Or a company's, maybe? <sighs> Nothing yet. And most of those leave a signature of some sort in their work, too. <sighs> Anyway, I'm gonna keep cracking at it from home. I'll let you know once I find anything new. You got this. Don't stay up too late, okay? I can walk you home. I can walk you home. Futaba's my chosen girl out of all of these, so yes. I'm good. It's just around the block. I mean, I was doing it for my own sake, not well, yours, folks, but thank you. Time for me to make like a tree. And fuck off. <laughs> That's a quote she from. Made like a tree? Yep. Time to make like a tree and leave is the real one, but good night to Fataba and headed to bed ourselves. Okay. Ah. Boy, was that a hell of a day. I never would have imagined something like this would happen. Right? I hear you there. All we can do is get ready. I just wanted to have fun. I hear you there. You're a real Let standard. Sojiro know. That just might mean you're going to see some trouble again soon. Alice, Emma, this new metaverse, a mountain of mysteries sure is piling up fast. Well, yeah, the yeah. metaverse reappearing may have been a surprise, but even that doesn't compare with Sophia. Did you call for me? We were just talking about how you're a huge mystery, says the talking cat. <laughs> uh, good point. Well, he was a mystery for the better part of a year. I don't have to take that from some mystery app. By the way, <laughs> how does some top-of-the-line program lose all its memory, huh? I mean, AI are supposed to be super smart, right? That is... inarguably true. Aw, oh, don't get too down over it. I am humanity's companion. If I am not helpful, then I am useless. Don't be so hard on Ouch. yourself. At least you remember that much, right? Right. I think that means it's important. Exactly. But is being helpful all you'll do to become a good companion? Is that not how it works? Please explain. How else can one be a companion? Huh? Well, uh... <laughs> That's... Ugh, uh, you walked into a minefield. have to find a way to understand the human heart. Hearts? Yeah, right. Then you'll be able to empathize with other people. And be a good companion to them. That is actually a really good answer. Look, just, just don't worry about it. All you need to do is join us and learn from all the kinds of people we meet. In exchange, you lend a hand to the Phantom Thieves. So I guess you could call this a deal. Ooh, okay. ooh, ooh, Arcana, Arcana, Arcana. Especially since it should help me become a good companion for Give me an Arcana card. Yep. Give me an Arcana so card. It's good with our leader. Give me an Arcana card. Give me an Arcana card. Of course. Thank you, leader, boss, captain. Then it's a deal. Glad to have you on board, so Give me an Arcana card. We've got plenty of scouting to do tomorrow. We should get some rest. Give me an Arcana okay. card. Good night, Morgana. Give me an Arcana card. 
Are you fucking me? Are you fucking me? Where's my fucking Arcana card? No, turn auto off. I don't know. I'm angry. Where's my fucking Arcana? They, they made up their own fucking Arcanas for... What is it? Kasumi and... The other guy? Where the fuck's my Arcana? I don't give a fuck if it's some stupid ass... Like, the AI card. I don't care. I wanted to see it. Ah, uh, it's been so long since I unlocked a new Arcana. Uh, I'm actually, I'm actually legitimately disappointed in everything that just went down. Like, glad to have her on the team, but like... Let's be real, I want the fucking Arcana card. Please, for the love of fuck. Back to our former hideout in Shibuya to check, go check out the jail together. And the police are after us again, so... If this is one of our known spots, then that's probably not that great. Great. Everyone's here. We're going to be infiltrating the jail. Are we ready? We've done oh. this many a time. I can't imagine anyone being phased by this. <laughs> yeah, bro! Bring it! We're very <laughs> short on intel, so we need to be cautious. We'll just scout the general area for this trip. We yeah. use Emma to enter, right? Is there anything special we need to do? Um... No, we just opened the app and said the right keyword. Find the right name in Emma's search results, then enter the correct keyword on the friend request screen. Yeah, you got it, Futaba. Ah, leave it to the super hacker to explain this stuff. Exactly. That had nothing to do with hacking. Even you should know how to explain it. Yeah. All that's left is to choose our point of entry. There will be no enemies in the area from which we escaped yesterday. Upon reaching the relevant location, you will only need to speak the keyword. Seems nice. all that's left is to trust Sophia and see where she leads us. Let's do this thing. I feel like... I honestly feel like the whole thing with uh, Morgana, where Morgana like kind of lost his stuff. This is a loading screen. I know this now. But so, where Morgana lost like his ability to be the navigator, I feel like that's going to happen to Futaba over the course of this game, and that's going to be a plot point. He's helping Futaba out. Well, did we make it? I feel for sure that's going to be a plot point. Because let's be for real, that would be foreshadowed. That would be understood. And for Futaba's character, that's the next place to take it. So we just got to be careful when we speak to Futaba about Sophia. Let's be real. Oh, your phantom thief attire. Yep. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Forgotten this feeling. The fusion of form and function. Truly, Truly magnificent. Look, Thank you. It's Beauty Thief. <laughs> My name is Beauty Thief. <laughs> she did it. She Let's did it. not fool around here. She did it. I admit though, these clothes do bring back some memories. We can reminisce later. Take a look at that view. Yeah. So this is the jail? Just what is that building? This place is bonkers! Nothing escapes the atrocious color scheme of this place. It looks like that because of someone's cognition, correct? Yep. Right. Most likely Alice's. The distortion has to be exceptionally strong there for a reason. So you're saying that's Ooh, the that weird of smoky shit. ruling over this jail. Its appearance certainly fits the notion. Yeah. The buildings around here still look pretty normal, though. Looks like that place over there has a limited range of distortion. The first time we came here, we entered by the crossing down there. That's where we saw a group of cop shadows taking stuff out of people's chests. Oh, you mean that jewel we saw? The hell was up with that? That may have been a desire. Yep. That's what they said. Yo, phantom thieves. <laughs> ah, Sophia! Holy crap, an actual AI in human form! Wow, <laughs> you're so cute, Sophia. Such a fascinating form you've taken. I can't stop staring at the beautifully curved lines. Oh, wow. I've never seen an outfit like that. Can I try floofing it? Floofing? <laughs> floofing? <laughs> I think she wants to get a feel for the fabric of your clothes while hugging you, Sophia. Request denied. I am neither a child nor a pet. Bye-bye. <laughs> <No, laughs> How does H work for an AI? Not right now. Sophia. Tell us more about the desire you mentioned. That is the term used by shadows here. 
They say things such as, seize their desires, and we must offer these desires to the monarch. Based on their language and behavior, I speculate the aforementioned jewel was in fact a desire. That does make sense. Ah. When we saw Alice here, she mentioned desires too. So if Alice is the monarch, then she really is the ruler of this jail. But these desires, are they actually made up of the things people desire? Seizing desires of all things. What use would they have for those? Finding out what happened to the folks who got jumped <clears throat> could tell us something. Where could those victims be now? I don't see a place from here where they may be held. So, I don't think they're being held. I think they just die. Because uh, in the first palace when he's talking, uh, Morgana is explaining what would happen to Kamoshida if you took all of his desires, which is what it looked like they were doing. They're just like ripping desires left and fucking right. So, I'm just saying, it'd probably just kill him. I think that's the consequence of this game, is that people are just fucking dying, my mans. So, let's see what we can do with that. Let's see if we can't kick some ass and get these fuckers to no longer be murdering assholes. I don't know. Maybe they're being held somewhere else. Say, about those people you witnessed being attacked, are you sure they were humans? Yep, what we do you saw mean? Them. Couldn't they have been shadows or something? Or if there are humans getting captured and imprisoned in this jail right now, wouldn't there be a huge commotion in our world? Groups of people going missing out of the blue. Now there's a point. I haven't heard a peep about that online. So no one is actually disappearing from reality? Huh. I see. Shadows. What are shadows? Oh, a maybe shadow their eyes were yellow and I didn't notice. suppressed within your subconscious. It's basically just your other self. Does that mean their main selves are all right? No. The shadow and the actual self are two sides of the same coin. So if a desire is taken from someone's shadow, what happens to the person in reality? I gotta say, I'm getting a bad vibe from all this. Yeah. Are they trying to influence oh. reality by doing something to the shadows? Look at that portal back there. You can see, like, weird distorted reflections in it. That's kind of cool. I just noticed Futaba showing up there for a second, and I was like, huh. And then you see, like, Ryuji's hair, I assume, and then there's Futaba again. You kind of start to see some others, but yeah, it's kind of kind of big. That's kind of cool. And how are we to act? This sounds like a crisis. Shouldn't we rescue the victims right away? No, that was just speculation. After all, we've only witnessed the cognitive world side of things. Until we find out how all this is affecting the real world, we can only know half of what's going on. I'd say the first thing we need to do is investigate Alice and her victims. Plus, if we make the wrong move in the cognitive world, there's a chance the ruler could have a shutdown in the real world. Right. We need to get the story straight before we make any real moves or we'll just be doing damage. Yeah, and we'll end up with a Haru's dad, basically, is what we'll end up doing. Let's look into Alice, let's look into her victims, let's look into catching some Z's. What? No, what the fuck? Why would I even... Okay. Let's look into the victims. The Phantom Thieves are men and women of the people. We can try, but... Hello, Sammy. You really think we can just stumble on them like that? Maybe if we look into people who have changed recently, we could get some leads? What say we get into that once we're out of here? Okay, yeah. let's get out of here. <sighs> Why is on getting all weird? 